Hi there, I'm Alexey, a product manager at Pandadoc. And here is a video about creating documents from PDF in Pandadoc API. In our previous video, we covered how to work with Postman, the tools that we are using in this video as well. And we've covered how to create a document from Pandadoc template. Please refer to this video if you need additional guidance. Today, we will take a look at these two new methods, create a document from PDF with form fields, and create a document from PDF with field tags. Let's start with this one. As usual, we can click here and see a description for this particular method. We can find that for details and sample PDF, we can go to this particular link and we can find additional links about Pandadoc API, document creation, document creation from PDF as well. Let's just click this link and we are redirected to our developers portal with some examples. We can see that uh, field tags, it's a way to create a document from PDF that has this particular uh, type of uh, field tags. They are looking like this. So first of all, we have a type of the field, then we uh, can see this optional sign that denotes that field is optional or not. We have a role name and ID, which we can use to provide the values for fields in our uh, API calls. And also, if we need to have a field of different size, we can use underscores to enlarge the field size. Basically, that's it. Now, let's just try to make the call. Here, we can find a PDF that, can, that we can use. And here it is. I will just download it. And yeah, got it. Now let's go to the call itself. Here in headers, as usual, we have this access token, which we already filled in in our previous videos. And here we have a body of the request. We need to provide a file that we've just downloaded. Just choose the file, select this PDF. And here is in data, we have a actual call that we will make. We have recipients, fields, metadata, and this parse from fields is false as we are not using um, creating PDF from form fields. In our particular case, we are using field tags right now. So it's important to understand that we need to provide value for fields and we have several fields in our PDF. Let's come back to it. We have uh, this text username that we want to fill in during creation and we have checkbox user like that we need to fill in during our creation. That's why we have uh, our set parameters ID here. And for example, these fields, they will be uh, filled in by recipient itself, not by us. So we are providing values only for fields that we uh, fill in uh, during creation of a document itself. Uh, additional remark here is that, as usual, if we will not change this email right now, we want to be able to receive notification when document will be sent, as this is an example uh, email and we won't be able to get notification for it. I will just change it for my own email so I can show you how notifications look like. So now we will set and I can click send. And yeah, request is successful and as usual, document is arrived in document uploaded state. It means that it still needs some processing on Pandoc side and we still need to wait until it becomes draft, not uploaded. To do it, we can go to document status. And as usual, here on the test, we are setting environment variable with correct value for document ID. So in document status method, we will, we will get the status of the document that we've created the last. I just click send and can see that the document is in draft right now. So we can proceed with it. Let's go to um, Pandadoc account and see how this document looks like in our user interface. And just go to documents and last one was created just a minute ago. Let's click. And yep, here it is in draft state. And some values are already filled in, for example, this name and this checkbox. And everything else is left for the recipient to, uh, to fill in. So as usual, we can uh, click complete or send depending on the recipient here in the user interface, or we can go to Postman 
and send this document via API as usual. Let's just do it. And yeah, we can see this document is sent. Here we can reload the page to some draft. And now it's sent. And I have also a notification from Pandadoc that I've just got this document. Now let's check the second method. We just created a document from field tags. Let's take a look at form fields. Here, the same access token, the same body, but a bit different set of fields. And as usual, we can take a look at description and see that we also can get sample PDF. Let's go there. It's important to understand that field tags and form fields are different stuff, so we need separate PDFs to test each of this method. I've just went to another one. And what is PDF form fields? It's just a feature that we can enable setting this sparse form fields value to true, and that some PDF editors are supporting this particular stuff. So let's download this PDF. And here it is. As usual, we can just download it and take a look that it's just a feature of some PDFs where we can select values and do something uh, inside PDF editor itself. So just a different format. Let's go to Postman. I will just choose file for form fields. And one more time, let's do here. The most important distinction between uh, form fields and field tags is that we need to provide values for all fields, even if we are not going to use them. So for example, we are not going to fill in this home address field during creation of this uh, file, of this document. But we still need to provide empty value or our request will fail. And here, parse from fields is true as we are using from fields. As usual, I will change email to my own. And just send this document. It's uploaded. Let's check its status. It's still uploaded. And now it's draft. Let's take a look how it looks like inside our user interface. And yeah, here it is in draft. And some values are filled in, and some values are left for the recipient. We can send this document via API as well. And check that everything's OK. Document was in draft, and now it is sent. And here we can take a look at notification that uh, this document arrived to recipient. So it's all about creation of uh, documents from PDFs in Pandadoc API. Thanks for your time and have a nice day. Bye-bye.